How's it going out there? This is Feed Your Mind, and in today's video, I'm going to share with you this new picture I discovered on Google Earth in Antarctica. And so, if you notice in this picture, it looks like a huge fortress or something that was established around these lakes. Now, I've listened to some experts analyze this strange structure in Antarctica, and a lot of them are saying that they believe that this is some type of primitive civilization that might have created this structure in Antarctica. And they're thinking that this was created a long time ago so then that leads us to analyze if this structure was built at a time when Antarctica might have been hospitable like in a time when Antarctica might have been much warmer so I've done research on well, there's new there's a new hypothesis about how Antarctica could be melting, and I explained that to you in um, one of my previous videos because we discussed how the sun, the circle of the sun, might be moving, and so with this theory, the circle of the Earth would be much bigger. It would be a huge circle. And the sun would be a smaller circle within a huge circle. So the sun would rotate in a circular motion around a specific area on this larger circle and would create a mini circle inside of a larger circle. And this mini circle would rotate around the entire circle, the bigger circle. So people would have to migrate with wherever the sun goes and eventually um you come back around so with this theory you can have an antarctica that's revealing more and more as the sun moves so as the sun migrates around this larger circle parts of our land that we live in now would not be hospitable because it would become colder because the sun wouldn't reach certain areas as the sun moves you see this process would take a very long time thousands of years each time eons and maybe that's what ages are in eons as the sun moves around and so we're just brainstorming here so this is just a thought a exercise and um we're, we're just um hypothesizing about this subject but it's a very uh, profound hypothesis actually um so and that would also explain ice ages where yeah so eventually where we are living now like if um so u.s would end up eventually becoming a frozen land like antarctica and nobody would be in this area eventually and then everybody would be migrating with the sun and so as the sun migrates around, Antarctica would end up revealing a lot of secrets with this theory. And as the sun moves, it would start melting areas in Antarctica that were previously on has, um, on livable conditions. And then eventually as the sun moves, this um, we'd end up seeing the melting of the snow and then Possibly it would reveal a lot of secrets about ancient civilizations. And so another scientific study that kind of confirms this theory is that scientists actually confirm that the magnetic north is moving. And we're going to get into that in another video, but that's just one of the, I mean, at that point I can you know, we'll, we'll, we'll cover that hypothesis deeper where they're saying that the 
North Pole is moving and if there's any connection to that and if we even believe that the North Pole is moving. So we'll, we'll cover all that in another video. But for now, I'm just letting you know that that's kind of like a hypothesis that fits well with this theory. So it's possible that Antarctica is revealing secrets of ancient civilizations, but there's other explanations for this. I mean, let me know in the comment section. What do you think about this picture? Do you what is your personal hypothesis about this picture? What do you think this is? Because this would cover miles like this structure. It's it was intelli it looks intelligently put there. Now, I'm I'm kind of okay with what these experts are assuming that this was some type of primitive setup that is being revealed in Antarctica due to the to the uh, melting of the snow. And plus, we have evidence of Antarctica melting with a lot of the icebergs um, breaking off, and a lot of the so so this has been going on for years now, where they're saying that the um. Antarctica is missing chunks of land as, as, as they end up breaking off from being melted. And then they're going to try to tie that in with the climate change discussion. And then maybe this is just a natural thing that's going on. Like we, like we've been discussing in this video. So then all the scientists and everybody gonna, are going to start panicking like, Oh, the things are melting and the world is getting warmer and global warming and all that stuff. But really, it could just be a cycle of this earth and we're, we're not being told the truth. You know, like this could be a normal thing that's going on. And so. um, Let me know what you guys think about this picture. I mean, so this picture was discovered on Google Earth. And when it comes to Google Earth, I mean, we don't know if this picture was manipulated. Like, so. Google could be trolling us with this picture as well. Because, you know, I mean, I don't know if it's Google's the most trusted uh, name in our community. You know, we see all the things that they're they're doing. So, uh, you know, this this whole thing, could, they could have made this thing appear like that with uh, Photoshop. They could have they could have made this image, this structure. So we got to take that into consideration as well. But if it is a legitimate photograph that is being uh, that has been discovered on Google Earth, then, you know, that's that's why we're analyzing it either way, whether it's um, whether it's manipulated, whether it's a manipulated image or not, it's still worth analyzing and trying to figure out what this is. So, like I said, I'd like to know your take about what do you think? this structure is what are your thoughts on it i'll leave a link in the comment section and the description box if you want to do more research about antarctica and, and um i also leave a link if you'd like to donate to the channel you can donate as little as a dollar to help keep things going here at feature mind i also leave links to my other channels and my social media and please like comment share and subscribe to help push this video forward to more people help help get this um let's, let's help get these um you know, your your um, participation in these videos helps things because uh, they try to hide these videos. So anyways, thanks for tuning in. This has been Feed Your Mind signing off.